Okay, let me give you the plot representation of a magnetic field. So as we as we have discussed the theorem, we can we can we can get, uh, define a magnetic field in that way. There exists a U and F, uh, where F is a flux label, uh, such to express a magnetic field. And if this we can have this, then there always exists a G such that um, such that this 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 statement holds. Then B then the B can be expressed in, in terms of this. And for without losing uh, general generosity, we could express G in terms of in in, in this way. Uh, for properly expressing magnetic field. Uh, so, so we plug the G into this expression, and we know that the, uh, the a, a R is, uh, is in the derivative, a, a gradient of A R is in the R direction. And uh, since F is a flux label, then then if we do a zero parallel, then the, the cross product will be will go to zero. So we're left with uh, this, this expression. So that of course the cross product if flipped it will go become negative. That's the case for this term, and then this becomes this because we can correct gradient of this and gradient of that gradient. Gradient of A will go to zero, so we only left with A gradient of cross grant theta. And uh, let's try to social. So this is the general form of uh, magnetic field. And let's try to express the magnetic field in terms of uh, of the Froido and Froido fluxes. So here is the definition of Froido flux. Uh, we can write the volume for a torus, uh, the volume element will look like this. And, uh, and we plug the V in here, and this is V, and to grab theta, and that's the volume element. So that's the expression. So we know that uh, for so the grad, uh, so the, the grad theta is uh, the, 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 the magnitude of that is one over r plus r cosine theta. So we can think is in a way a curvature. So like the, in the uh, in the toroidal direction, and the same you know, similar idea, and the, the one over r is like toroidal curvature in a sense. Uh, we know we know this this term will be zero because cross dot with the same uh, same vector will be zero. And uh, we're only left with this term and this term cross and dot it will be uh, be one uh, like the, the sorry, the goal will be in the same direction in, in the radial di direction. Like this, the radial direction. So, so D, uh, D, uh, dr and then this will be cross theta theta dot theta. That this will be the theta direction and then theta. So this has to be a theta direction, but this has to be in the r direction. Um, So this is one over r plus r cosine theta, and this is one over r. And this volume element cancels out. This whole thing cancels out. We're left with only this, df dr, and then it integrated them become f. This thing become f, and we integrate it in terms of Froelian, Froelian, Froelian angle. Then it will become two pi square. Then that's one. For this is for Freudo flux, uh, uh, Freudo flux, and similar idea applies to the Freudo flux, 
and now that you are up to this point, we, we, we notice that the A is a function of radius. So we have this expression, and dr dr cancels out. We do the uh, ddt on both sides, I'm uh, sorry, ddl on both sides, we have phi, uh, phi t, phi d, d phi t, uh, d psi t over d df equals a 2 pi and 1 over 2 pi cancels out. So, so we can express, so we know that f can be expressed in terms of a broidal flux, then, then a can be expressed in terms of a d psi t psi psi t broidal, broidal flux over broidal flux, derivative of broidal flux. These are d psi t or d psi t. And this is the definition of a safety factor. Uh, so in the in conclusion, the magnetic the magnetic field can be expressed in terms of psi p, the proidal mag, uh, proidal magnetic flux and the safety factor. And this whole thing will be a uh, Toroidal magnetic field, and this 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 side will be the toroidal magnetic field. Put into the torus, this is the magnetic. The red line is a magnetic field line, and we trace one of the magnetic field line, and then uh, decompose it into toroidal, which is like a like a round donut, like like the smallest cross section, and the toroidal is like around like a circle of the donut. And this is the flux representation of a magnetic field.